I'm going to walk you through an overview of our grants portal. Once you log in, you will see that this page is called Grantee View or also Grantee Dashboard. There are a few ways to complete actions on this page. One is to use the quick links down here and the other is to navigate between these tabs. From this page, you are able to apply for a grant, view your application and payment history, as well as update your profile. I am going to walk you through a few new features that we have on this page. Once you begin your application by completing the prerequisite questions and choosing the grant program you would like to apply to, you will land on the first page of the application called Application Process. There are a few things to note on this page. You are now able to upload all your documents from this page. You can navigate between the four sections of the application in order to complete the narrative portion, but you will not be able to submit your application until you have uploaded all of the required documents. You can view the list of required documents by clicking this link that will take you to a PDF that explains what each document is requesting. To view all of the applications you have submitted to the Community Foundation, you would click Application History, choose the timeline of your when your application was submitted, and it will automatically search for that time range. Down here you will see a few things. One is your application date, the amount you requested, the approved date if it was approved, as well as the status. You are also able to view the PDF of your applications. You are now able to edit your personal information through the grants portal. You will see here that you can edit your personal information, your addresses, and your email and phone numbers. You can also change your password as well as update your security question.